with more than 50 talented Cameroonian promoters of the mid in Cameroon participating in the second edition of Le Weekend du Met in Cameroon, taking place at the Douala Grand Mall from the 2nd to the 5th of December, an opportunity to discover a variety of local products and the creativity of Cameroonian entrepreneurs. Entrepreneurs who have distinguished themselves in almost every sector, cosmetics, liquor, food supplement, mold and decorations drawn from every corner of the country. Under the patronage of the Ministry of Trade, the regional delegate of small and medium-sized enterprises, Bala Ngono Marie Beth, who officiated the ceremony to open the various stands to the public, appreciated the ingenuity of these Cameroonians. We are happy to discover all these products made in Cameroon and we want to encourage all Cameroonians to come and visit and to buy uh, all these products to encourage our SMEs and our craftspeople. Producers who, in themselves, identify a number of difficulties they go through. Firstly, Cameroonians don't believe in nails. They don't believe you can give them good products. When they come here, they see made in Cameroon. Some of them are very discouraged. They don't want to buy. They feel like maybe what we are doing is not, I don't know, maybe it's not good for their, for their, for their skin. Or maybe the products we are using are not original. I don't know. They just have one mentality. They don't believe that we can produce something or any product that is really going to match their their skin tone. We're missing some uh, visibility. Uh, people here in Cameroon doesn't uh, I think they, they don't uh, understand all the work that we're doing here and we, more, we need more uh, mediatization that people come and, and uh, we, so that will be good that we organize some, uh, some um, craft uh, lesson. And to these, they would wish the government to assist them so as to boost production. They should try to give up loans to young entrepreneurs that we can produce, sell, and then pay them back. It's not like we're asking for years. We can pay them back, and they should also try to encourage producers of raw materials here in Cameroon for cosmetic products. O organize workshop with the with all the the population, so people can uh, 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 knows how we're working. That's what I want them to do. Production, which they attest that respect standard and quality. It's a lot of quality because I've been, uh, uh, I study in Puerto Rico to do that. I learn how to, to make jewelry. I have a master degree of jewelry. Uh, all my products, all the après that you see, it's quality. For example, you see all these, it's not do, going black, black. So all what I'm doing, it's quality. With the African continental free zone gradually becoming a reality, these Cameroonian entrepreneurs are totally ready to take the made in Cameroon label beyond the national boundaries. We are now ready to sell our products everywhere in the world. Yes, so, we, it is no more necessary for us to go abroad or to, to import uh, many, many products. It will then be the place of every son and daughter of this country to patronize the made in Cameroon label.